Can you hear me? So David's stuck in traffic. Promise he'll make it. <clears throat> he said he's like five minutes away, so I'm just gonna start. He's coming, he's coming. Oh, I was gonna do Clear Blue Day. On a clear blue day, does the sun get in your eyes? Land above faith, does the light him return? Please forgive me, I felt the rain Within the sunlight, oh, I felt a drop of pain Yeah, what do you feel? I know by now, better be this time I've been traveling for so long Deserve a little bit of this life. I deserve a little bit of you. Ah, he made it! Or is that a stunt double? I don't know. I don't know. My feet in the sand is an empty breeze. I don't know if David's gonna be able to make it. This is his uh, stunt double, Fred. Ah, there's a familiar wind blowing out to sea. Wanna run, I wanna chase it, wanna swim the seven seas. Familiarity, won't you come? Won't you come running back to me? Nobody now better be this time. Give me love, give me light. I've been traveling for so long. Overdrive, hundred miles. I deserve a little bit of this life. A little smile. I deserve a little bit of you. Yeah. A little creepy. Is that a little creepy? <laughs> Is that a little, and a little hot. Oh my god. <laughs> That's David Young! Forgot what that was like. Woo! <laughs> Damn. That's awesome. Yeah. So this morning, he had his helmet in his hand, and I go, Where'd you get that? But I didn't realize he also had a piece of gum in his hand. And he goes, At Costco. So this entire day, I thought he got that helmet at Costco. And then I'm like, He it's goes really to put good. it on, and I'm like, That is. That Helmet is like awesome. It's like we used to have. I can't believe you got that at Costco. He didn't get it at Costco. <laughs> Where did you get no. there your helmet? Uh, I'm not allowed to say. Oh. It's a secret. But it was a uh, secret helmet maker. Made very well, yes. Under wraps. Under wraps? I want one. Well, well, I'm sure now that you've said that, somebody will send you one for free. Oh my god. Isn't it weird because you can't hear everybody talking? But let me tell you guys. I've been sitting there, creeping <laughs> on you, reading all your stuff for the last hour. She Hilarious. Has. I've actually been reading them out loud because it's the funniest conversations. And Jackie, you crack me up. I loved when, um, <laughs> who's the guy who wanted to ask a question? And you just kept going, so what's the question? <laughs> so what's the question? Did you ask your question? I don't, I don't, I don't think he ever asked it. You I don't were think right. Did either. <laughs> I don't think we were watching it. for it. We were waiting. I was trying to find the question. <laughs> oh, I'm sure everybody sees my shirt too. It's David's got a cute shirt. Nice I have a cute with... shirt. You have a great shirt. This girl Hannah gave this to me last night at my show. Isn't it really cool? It is. Even though you're an expat now, almost, so you know you should have a Canadian shirt. I am. I'm a, both. A I'm U.S. Both. shirt. Yeah. Ta -da! Um. All right. Shall I sing another song? It would be great, David, if you could sing along. <laughs> yeah, it would be great if I could, but uh, I don't quite have those skills. Can you dance? Can you? I can think of something. Okay. <laughs> a little something for you. Right, up, right? Up a little shit. A little go-go. A little go-go dance. A little go-go, yeah. Okay. Take it along. Um, I'm going to do Cracker Jacks. It's a good song. Do you want to take your shirt off? <laughs> no, but thank you. Do you want to take your shirt off? Shoot! Sure. <laughs> okay. Three days. 
days and 40 nights We're just trying to make things right We discovered we're all the same So pick your piece and move in fast And spend your life trying to make it last Interpretation of modern dance. You know what? I think you could start a whole thing. Like I could that. make little short films with just like Blue Ranger, just total Blue Ranger dolls. Doesn't Jason Frank do that? Oh yeah, he he his daughter does something called doll talk. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. Whoops. <laughs> All right, I won't do it. Jason's already done. Awesome. That's awesome. Okay, so I have these questions that Jackie has um, collected again. Which, <laughs> thank you very much, Jackie, for that. I appreciate it. Hey, I'm just gonna check in real quick. Can you guys hear us? Is everything okay? Can you see us? Okay, cool. Cool. All right. Um, how about Tamsin? It's a cool name, right? Tamsin, yeah. Tamsin asks, well, I've sort of, uh, she asked a question, um, the hardest and the easiest characters that you've ever played. Um, the hardest. Oh, we're boring, David. <laughs> He's left. He got a little bored. Anyway, my hardest character to play was, um, I don't know, probably, God, I don't know. I'm just thinking maybe, the first thing that pops in my head is perfect body. Because that was, that was a tough. It was fun. I like the tough roles, too. Mm -hmm. It's really fun. You were really good in that. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks, David. That was a good role for you. Yeah. 
And then the easiest draw, oh, you know what was the tough, was the Christmas movie I did this year. Oh my god, you guys. I am not 50 years old, and I had to play a 50-year-old, and they put gray in my hair. I told a lot of you guys last time. And um, and I'd go in the makeup chair, and then, then they would cover, like, draw in my lines, and then I'd walk around acting like an old lady. Now, when you're 50, you're not old, right? <laughs> and anyway, so if I don't know if you guys have seen the movie. Everybody is super great in this movie, except for... <laughs> this girl me and my sister were laughing at my performance in that movie so hard it is ridiculous how about you uh well i mean the hardest i think all my roles are hard yeah yeah just because you know you want to make sure that you bring something to them i did an independent film uh where i had to play a guy that kind of turned on all of his friends and uh, had a black goatee and black hair and uh Ended up setting everybody up, and they all got killed and stuff like that. So it was hard just because I'm not uh, a macho kind of guy. You're not? You're <laughs> no. so macho. <clears throat> <clears throat> so macho. Oh! oh. Go ahead. What are, we, what are we doing? What you're going to do, mm -hmm. I'm going to sing. I'm going to sing. Relief. Mm. And David is going to just morph <laughs> during the song. What? what do you think, guys? <laughs> David's gonna morph That's nice. while I sing. How, how do I morph? Oh. We're all just trying, trying hard to find relief. So hope all of us can keep on standing through all this grief. We're all just pretending, and it's hard to see. Underneath this exterior, you're just like me. Don't give up. You're almost home. Just take my hand, and I won't let go. Your arms getting tired. Round and round, together we will roam till we find relief. It's painful to see But within this final ending You might agree Don't give up You're almost home Just take my hand And I, I won't let go we're all just pretending. Can I see this thing? Yeah. Oh my God, I'm sweating just holding that. It's like, excuse hey, me for just. I want the pterodactyl one. Oh, this is a. This is the. This is better than what we used on the TV show. Oh my goodness. It's like all Heavy. metal. It's got weight. Yeah, it's the Legacy Morpher. There you go. Don't get it. There you go. Maybe you say pterodactyl. <laughs> they would, they'd go ape shit if you would do that. You might get some, never mind, I was going to say you get some tips that way. <laughs> nice. Uh. <clears throat> David just has to, <laughs> he had sweaty pits. He's cleaning out his pits over there. Oh! Oh. Look what David got me! Yes, he did! I'm going to wear it. Oh, gonna wear my sweatshirt. <laughs> Twinsies. Yeah. Twinsies. How's that? I don't know. Let's see. Good. Let's 
let's check out the feedback. Are we okay? Love it. Cool. Yes. Oh my God. Yes. What is uh, that? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> what did he say? <laughs> I don't know. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Go, go. <laughs> yeah, so, mm -hmm. so here we are. What do you think, guys? Can people do screen grabs of this and like then plaster the this all over the it's internet? It's the Pink Ranger! Yeah! Somebody's taping it. Oh, really? Yeah. And then what do they do? Put it on YouTube. Oh, great. I thought this was like Snapchat, where it just disappears and nobody has a record I of it. I told you that. So I would do it? Yeah. Oh, great. No, come on. We don't mind. What do you guys think? Okay, let's do a question. Oh, yeah. Annie, why did you move to... Annie asked me, why did I move to Montreal? Oh, my dear God. Joe, is this too much? Should I take it off, Joe? <laughs> Should I take off the sweatshirt? <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Leave it on for now. Hey, Vincent Chan, guess what? Last night I tried to sing you a song, and this guy over here didn't know how to work the camera. No, the camera kept saying uh, memory card error. <laughs> so we wanted to record a song for you, Vincent, So because you gave money to Amy Jo's uh, yeah, Indiegogo Indi campaign. It was awesome. And that was part of was your, awesome. what do you call it? Uh, song Sang For You. I yeah, was going to do my Song Sang For You, Vincent, last night at um, Hotel Cafe. Um, but I, I screwed up. He couldn't work my camera. So yeah. I'll do yours next week, I promise. Okay. Um, why did I move to Montreal? Because I was tired and done with Los Angeles at the time, and I heard about Montreal. I went there, I did a little movie of the week, <clears throat> and I thought, oh my god, this is like the coolest city. I loved it. And Annie is from Montreal, actually. And um, so I, uh, I fell in love with the city, and then I met my husband, and, and then, uh, yeah, I... Uh, I love Montreal. It's, a, it's, a very, it's really cool. Yeah. It's really pretty. It's awesome. It's very French. I tried to learn French. Didn't didn't work out. But my uh, little girl speaks French, so that's pretty Bonjour. cool. Bonjour. Oui, vous plaît. <laughs> oui, vous plaît. <laughs> si, vous plaît. Si, vous plaît. Oh. Um, <laughs> no, it's oui. No. Oui, oui, oui. Oui is yes. And what is si? Yeah, I don't know. Si, si vous plaît or si te plaît is uh, thank you. Or no, uh, please. Oh, si vous plaît. Oui. Can we take these off now? I'm hot. I'm hot too. I kind of like mine though. Look, you look good. I like mine. Um, all right. <clears throat> <clears throat> Shall we sing some more? Um, for it. What do you think? Another song? You know a French song? Alouette, gentil alouette. Or um, oh, Frankie listens to French songs all the time. Um, um, oh, I can't remember right now. Anyway. <laughs> this is the longest 30 minutes oh, of no, David's life. Well, I mean, I just were. <laughs> isn't this the second to last song? Oh, I got more. Okay. That's fine. Um, okay. I'm a little hot too. Oh, this is awesome. Me and my pink ranger suit. This <laughs> <laughs> is awesome. Don't know me anymore. That's what I tell myself And all the pain that I've endured Is in a box up on a shelf I don't need you That's what I said And all the promises I have made Were just stories in my head Bright lights don't let
some good stuff. Thank you. I love that song. I love all your to. songs. Yeah, it's hot, huh? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's because I'm in California. It's not so hot. It's not so hot back home. No, but it's like 80 degrees here. Yeah, it's awesome. It's hot in here. Yeah. How are you guys? How's it going? Woohoo! West Side. Joe Van Ginkle's in the West Side. <laughs> I missed you last night, Joe. You had your show, though, right? Joe used to come to all my shows. Oh, really? Yeah, and Joe had a, I think Joe had a show last night. Are you acting, or? It was great. It was really fun. Yes, I did. I had a, um, I had a, there was a big crowd. It was a nice turnout. At your show? Yeah, big time. It was, it was super duper fun. We didn't get to record anything. Because of this guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. John Arnold, <laughs> no idea what embrace is. What is that? He always comes up with these questions from left field. John Arnold asked if I um, could sing Embrace or if I remember that song. What is that? What uh, song is that? It's Where something you? that you created? Um, well, apparently it is, but I seem to forget Embrace. everything that Maybe I Maybe it's just like a word in one of your songs? I don't know. I don't know, but he will let me know at some point. It's probably like I, I wrote it and sang it. I don't know. You're going to have to tell me. Where is John? Come on, John. Talk. You know, some, no, sometimes people um, have a lag and then oh. and they can't see. And anyway, oh, Joe was hosting a game show last night. Uh, Good job, Joe. That hence your Twitter name, Game Show Man, or something like that. John said he was going to be away from the show. That's what Vincent just told us. So, oh. Too bad, John. We. Oh, that's okay. John's in England. And he's been on the Twitter. I assumed he was going to be here because he was chit-chatting with all you guys. Yeah. Um, okay. Moving on. It's also like, what time is it there? I don't know. Whatever. Six hours. No, it's only, it's not that there late. are eight hours in Dallas. In California? Oh, I'm in California. Forgot I was in California. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, we got five minutes. Nothing left for you to do. We're done. <laughs> See you later, guys. No, we're kidding. Uh, we're just kidding. Um, oh. So <clears throat> I wanted to tell you guys about, uh -huh. I don't know if any of you are in New York City, um, but I'm going to be playing a show at the Bitter End, which is this really cool venue down in the village, 8 p.m., March 17th, happens to be St. Patrick's Day, I know, I'm not Irish though, so that's okay, but we're going to have a lot of fun, um, <laughs> yeah. I'm excited, I love the Bitter End, oh, David's going to be there too, David. Shh. I'm not allowed to say well, No, you, I'll be there. I'm excited that you're coming to New York with me. I'll be there. I'll be there. Yeah. At the bitter end. Yeah. I'll be a bitter man at the bitter end. Aww. Drinking my Irish beer. Aww. Bitterly. Aww. Poor me. And Just then, kidding. And then the following night, I'm going to be um, showing Bent, got into the New York, the new filmmaker, the New York Filmmakers um, Winter ser Series. Congratulations. Thank you. It's very exciting. Yeah. This girl... Big time director. Like all of her show, oh. all of our movies are getting into a lot of festivals. The festivals, yeah. And it's I just great. oh, Bent just got into a festival, the Boston International Film Festival. Awesome. So if anybody's in near Boston, that'll be in April. And if you just go to my website, I'll have all the dates posted up. Yeah. Um, and can I say something about New York City? About what I'm doing? Yeah, you can say whatever so, you want. So if you guys are in New York, I'm going to do two meet and greets, one on March 19th and one on March 20th. They're both sold out right now, but I'm going to open it up like for five more spaces in each one. So it's only going to be like 25 people per meet and greet. So it'll be nice and small and intimate and we'll have fun. And please come out to do that. You can go to my, uh, what is it, my Facebook page and private message me and ask me for details and I'll send it to you. Thank you. That sounds fun. It will be. All right. Um, okay. Well, I'm going to sing a song. <clears throat> to you? Sure. This is for David. Um, this is Dancing in Between. Oh. I actually wrote this song when I was doing a residency at the Bitter End. What song am I supposed to be singing right now? Am I supposed to be singing a different song? It's okay. <laughs> Just, never mind. It's all good. I'm throwing David off. It's all good. Sing what you're going to sing. Okay. <clears throat> I wrote this song when I was in New York and I um, was doing Love Janice. I told you guys this story um, off Broadway. Mm -hmm. Off, yeah, off Broadway. And, and I got fired. 
You got fired. I did. Me and Laura Branigan. That's too bad. No, was it Linda Ronstadt? Oh, God. I'm sorry. I can't remember. Oh! It was the, who died? Who was the woman who died? She had an aneurysm. I don't know. I'm just going to look up right now. Gloria. Gloria. Anyway. It's not Linda Ronstadt. Okay, so then it's... Laura Branigan. Laura Branigan. Mm -hmm. We were both playing Janice. Oh, you were? We both got... We both got... We got both got... Got the axe. We did. And the night before, my opening night, a man crawled through my window in New York City and stole my computer, and I woke up, and there was a man standing over my bed. Scariest moment of my life. I was on the third floor. And he scaled the side of the building, or what? He did. He did. Crawled through the window. I ran down the street with my mouth guard and my, <laughs> my pajamas on barefoot. Oh, my God. The night before my opening night. <laughs> It was, it was very scary. The mouth guard is something to uh, see for sure. Yeah. <laughs> the mouth guard in it because I, a little TMJ. <laughs> oh but anyway, then I had a bit, I had a, I still had my residency at the Bitter End, which Bitter End was across the street from the theater, so I'd have to go to the theater every Monday night and sing, and sing across the street from the, the show. The show. Doing the show, you got fired. <laughs> that sucks. And I would go and have dinner next door, and people would, they were, I was still on the bill for some reason, and people would have dinner, and they were like, well, I'm going to see you tonight. No. <laughs> I'm not sure why they let me go, but it was a little political thing. I'm not sure. It's too bad. That's what I like to say. Although I don't think I make the best Janis Joplin. God so scared, God so scared, it made me cry. I love David sticking out of my shoulder. <laughs> I'm so scared it made me cry The world took me for a ride Got so scared it made me laugh Took a life ride Now I'm dead, see me between Cause I've got no eyes Staying a little busy? Yeah Romance seem to see of my battered health insides Wonderful is the falling of a broken dream Printed on the cover of an AR magazine You have to do the same arm the entire song <laughs> Stop my hands, yo baby, I'll clap my feet Cause it's always another pounds. first man to meet Dancing in between Cause I got nowhere to hide Of my battered health insides, dancing in between, dancing in between. I'm just gonna keep playing. <laughs> Should we switch sides? You do the other arm? Why can't I find the camera? There we go. <laughs> yeah, baby. Woo! Look at that! And I'm really, I'm really not this egotistical, am I? Like where I'm like, oh yeah, I'm not. No, he's not like that at all. 
No, I'm just kind of not sure why he's doing that right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's his thing. We're just we're doing, gonna let we're, him. We're, we're gonna let filler. him go with it. We're gonna just let him. What can we do next? Oh, you guys, thanks for sticking around. Isn't that cool? So we have like uh, 17 more minutes if you want to hang out. You don't have to if you don't want to. But we're we're gonna be here until yeah. they kick us off. Because that's what we're gonna do, right? Yeah. Cool. <clears throat> Will you guys start um, um, typing where you're from? I just want to see like different places because I know it's like a lot of different places. People are from like England and Wisconsin, ooh, Spring, London. Texas, London, Chicago, Japan, Cincinnati, Austin, Philippines, Boston. Austin, Toronto, Norway, Croatia. Croatia. Oh, I love Croatia. Yes. You know I love New Croatia. York, Brazil, I've been to Croatia six Canada, times and Maryland. Bosnia, Ohio, Winnipeg. Brazil. Edinburgh, Edinburgh, Croatia, Croatia, Croatia. Croatia. Kelso. What is it? I'm Kelso. gonna go back soon. Cornwall, I can't wait. UK, New York City, Moscow, Michigan. We had somebody from Moscow. Actually. Florida, Bethlehem, Bethlehem, PA, Australia. What else? Bedford, England. Canada, West Virginia, Brazil. Nice, Brazil. Thanks, guys. New awesome. Jersey, so Burbank. Cool. <laughs> hey, Wonderful downtown Burbank, street. California. I love Another it. Another Russia. In Russia. Essex, UK. Yay. Nice. Croatia, come please. I love it. You know, my favorite place in Croatia is Korchula. I love it there. Yeah. I used to go do this camp for kids. Um, for kids. Helping kids out, yeah. It's yeah. very admirable. It's called Global Volunteers, and it was for kids from Bosnia. They would come to this little camp on in Croatia, and it would be three weeks of just playing. Get a little break from the war. Mm. Yeah. That's so sweet. Yeah. And uh, so I met this one little girl, Mia, and she became... Like one of my soul sisters, one of my best friends, she just got married last week. Oh, really? She was 10 when I met her. Oh, my God. And she's almost a doctor. Does she still live over there? She lives in Bosnia. In Bosnia? She lives in Sarajevo, actually. But wow. her mom lives somewhere else. Anyway, I love them. They're like, and I've, so I've gone back six times and just to visit Mia because I love her so much, her and her family. Yeah. And Taya. And, anyway. Anyway. Um, oh, gosh. Another song? Do I have any more songs that I uh, told you about that I was doing? Mm hmm it's clear for the day. The one about your movie. Oh! About your movie. Should I do lines or is that... What, what do you guys want to hear? Don't give me something crazy. Embrace. <laughs> John Arnold, don't... You're not allowed to... Oh, he's not here anyway. <laughs> <laughs> um, lines. Okay, I'm going to do lines. God. Okay, we'll see. We'll see where we're at. I'm going to do lines right now. My um, two of my oldest best friend um, girlfriends were at my show last <laughs> night. They sobbed uncontrollably through this entire song, where I could hear them. They were sitting in the front row, sobbing. One on David's shoulder, and then Melissa on her husband's shoulder, sobbing to the point where I almost started sobbing on the stage. I'm like, you guys, pull it together. Pull it together. Yeah. I stare at the light. Your face. We're gonna see David's lines. Remembering stories of heartache. I sing this one to David. Oh, the battlefields come and fun. Oh, the war wounds you've won. But I think they're beautiful. Here I stay, 42. 45. Good for you. Won't look back now, there's nothing we could do. Anything else you want to tell us? <laughs> <laughs> Miss the memories fade away. All of those lies are here to stay. So I think they're beautiful. No, 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 Jackie said she's 49. Oh. You're not old, Jackie. Time moves on. And some of us are gone. So please embrace all of those lights. On your face. Just think of them as beautiful. 
Sorry about the lag, guys. I don't know why it's lagging. It just depends on where they are. It's mm. not everybody. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna make up a song for you right now. David Yost, <laughs> you do you eat toast? I do. With peanut butter and jam. Raspberry jelly. David Yost is the most. What do you like most? Trying to rhyme something with jam. Do you like ham? But I, <laughs> I'm a vegan. I'm vegan, so no. Ham. 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 Okay. Um. All right, guys. We've got 11 minutes left. I'm gonna. What is that? What does that mean? I don't know. I know you guys probably know. Remember. Is this like a TV show or like what? What? What is this about? I mean, I've seen it at cons. I just. I just like it, but I don't know what it means. Somebody explain it. We could Google. Are you a vegan? I am. You are? Vegan-ish. You know what? I was at this guy's house the other night, getting all cozy to watch a movie, and he's, I say, let's order Thai food. He goes, sure, yeah, let's order Thai food. So I order chicken, garlic, my favorite. So I'm eating it, and I'm like, this is weird. It's like all brown chicken. He goes, there's no meat in that in that dish. It's oh, it, it was, was fake chicken. Like, who does that to somebody? It tastes the same. You don't even it know. Didn't taste you didn't the same. know. I mean, it was brown. It tasted good though, right? You ate all of it. I did. I did. I was hungry. You ate the whole thing. I was hungry. All right, I'm gonna sing one more song, just because it's time. Yeah. Um, oh. how about I'm gonna do Panic because I like Panic. I know. Ew, Melissa, right? Oh, no, I was fine with it. It was fine. I just, you know. Wasn't used to that. I'm back in LA, that's what they do here. Tastes the same. They take the meat out of the chicken. <clears throat> the curfew to the show automatically stops in 10 minutes. FYI. What is this world that we all have to bear? Is it the same as it is for you? Why are we going anywhere? I don't know. We all wake up in the morning and we all take a breath. Search for comfort, we all have our test. How are you? Pick up the pieces, kiss them goodbye. Keeps on moving, you don't even try.
after the long day is done, I hope you can look back and say, boy, that was fun. And all those tambourines are still ringing in your head. The next time you wake up, you're in somebody else's bed. Pick up the pieces, kiss them goodbye, 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 goodbye. Keeps on moving, you don't even try, you don't try, you don't try. Yeah. And the dandelion has its day to will sometimes and all the seeds fly. You think David's bored? <laughs> seeds fly away. They do. Yeah, they do. They do, David. And they land and create more dandelions. Dance, David, dance. <laughs> they want you to dance. Do they? They do. How exciting. Should he dance? I think that would be a really good idea. Yeah. Cut. I'm sure you do. See. No music. Just, Just dance. dance? Just dancing. What do you think about that, guys? I'm not, I'm not a big fan. Clap, clap, clap. That's nice of you guys. Ranger dance. Doing the range of days, doing the range of days. Ranger, Ranger. Nice. Does your helmet stink? No. Okay. Does my helmet stink? <laughs> Lies. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, it does stink a little bit, but not like you or anything. It's not like sweat. No, no, it's just no, 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 materials. No. Materials stink. It's pretty. It's pretty cool. I mean, it's really metallic. I, I like it. It's very nice. It's like the, the movie helmet. Like from the movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's They're great. more metallic -y. I'm going to get one at Costco. <laughs> <laughs> you said, where'd you get your gum? And I said, Costco, not where'd you get your helmet. They don't even sound alike. Yes. Helmet, gum. Helmet, I said, gum. where did you get your helmet? Where'd you get your gum? And I was looking at you like, Costco. Okay, Tia Mitt, Tia Mott, I don't know, whatever. Um, David, what is your favorite Power Ranger memory? I have a lot of them, but uh, for me, whenever anybody ever asks me that question, I always just say the camaraderie that the original cast had. You know, like we had such a good chemistry together. Um, we were so good friends. We were all pretty good we friends. We used to fight together. We all started the TV show together and went through the auditioning process fart. together. What? I said we used to fart together. <laughs> <laughs> No, that's not true. It's true. We were in a she, rad bug, and I had farted. some beans. She and used sorry to fart, guys, but I nobody, stunk them right out of the rad bug. Nobody else farted. You're so, I can't believe you bring Why? that up. Why? Everybody they can know that. I did yeah, it on that purpose. Yeah, that was a great memory. Uh, Billy used to have a car named the rad bug, and so we were all crammed in a little VW bug, and this girl farts. Hey, you guys, this is a really fun one. So if you look at the opening of like the original 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 series when we all pile up and we land on the floor of <laughs> of, of Zordon's the what's it called? Command Center. The command Center. <laughs> Look at this guy's face. Cause guess who farted? You did. I did I did the stinkiest fart and it's so funny. Oh it was your fart. No, it was your fart on my face. In the pile. Uh, in the pile. So watch when he gets out of the pile. Look at his face. He didn't like it. I enjoyed it a lot. <laughs> Such a gross girl. <laughs> <laughs> Am I grossing you guys out? Come yes. on. Come on. No, seriously, you have to look for that. <laughs> it's right there. It makes me laugh every time I see that. Oh, one. my God. I know. Forever. Forever and ever and ever. You guys will think of me really differently. <laughs> Whose phone's ringing? You don't turn up. You're on, that's, a, that's, you're on a TV I'm show sorry. right now. I'm sorry. I know. He has his phone ringing. Sorry. They can't sorry. hear it, though. Not very professional. No, it's not. You're right. What's the most embarrassing thing I could say about you? About me? Yeah, we got two minutes left. Hmm. I'm pretty, you know, professional, so I don't think there would be too many bad, embarrassing things. I'm trying to remember something funny. That would be really funny. 
that would be embarrassing for you, for me to share about you right now? There would be nothing. It was everybody always doing stuff to me, like you always farting on me. Jason well, that Frank. should be embarrassing to me. Jay, but. Exactly, but it's not. <laughs> Jason Frank. Um, <laughs> always doing something. He's crazy. Uh, yeah, Jason was very funny. He was, yes, he was. like, he was a nut. Um, okay, well, do, should I sing another song? Sing us out? We got two or do you want us to, just to chit chat? First answer. Chit chat <laughs> no, or a song? Uh, nah, nah, don't. don't. Just okay, talk. Actually, just just talk. talk. Oh, you like to chat. Okay. We're going to talk more about Power Rangers then, all right? <laughs> I, I don't know what to say. Um, well, what was your favorite memory of Power Rangers other than your farting? Farting on your face? Yeah. No, I'm kidding. Um, I don't know. I just had, I had a, I, yeah, like you said, I had a lot of fun with everybody. I liked all the episodes we did when we had to change characters. Yeah. Because as an actress and like just starting out, it was like, it was just exciting and finally fun to get sort of something a little bit challenging. So the so Power like, Ranger punks yeah. and switching places. Yeah. That was a good one. Like when I go back and I look at the pictures of you playing Billy. Yeah. Uh, it's really funny. Like you you had your lipstick smeared all over you. and. Yeah, yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Yes, the fun. And yeah. then I remember one episode I had to cry and I didn't know how to cry yet. So I made Twee. You didn't know how to cry. God. I'm sorry. <laughs> and I made Twee stand over in the corner and look at me really sadly. And she just, I just remember her, me sitting on the floor of the gymnasium looking at Twee trying to cry going. <laughs> <laughs> I think I pooped out one tear. That was about it. That was, that's all I got at that time. But now you know how to cry for TV I know how movies. to cry now. I think, you know, having my mom pass away. Like just, yeah, something enough to life yeah. to be able to work it out. At the time, I was 21, and, you know, life had been pretty grand. Yeah, so we got 30 seconds, really. 30 seconds! So Thanks thank for joining you. us, you guys. Honestly, thank you so much. Uh, I hope you had fun. Amy Jo is so talented. If you don't have her CD, please buy it, because it's really, really David. good. That's sweet. And uh, watch for her short films, because they're really good, too. She's going to... Oh, yeah, on my director. website, amyjojohnson.com, it'll be information, because we have um, a website of lines and bends and all that. Anyway. Anyway, you guys, this has been fun. Thank you, David.